City Award. Uh, the competition, uh, even practicing the skit, and then going to Anaheim and doing it in front of all the judges and then winning the award and recognizing that we were the only team or the only city that got the unanimous vote of all the judges. So that was really very special. Uh, the other thing as far as surfing, I think one of the most difficult things, among, one of the most difficult votes I had was when we voted on Walmart, the one on Beltline. And that was a marathon meeting. We went till 2 or 3 o'clock that morning. And I just felt it was very important to hear all the speakers, all the citizens to uh, listen to them. I knew that the vote would pass, but I was the only one who voted against it because I felt they needed to know that someone was listening to them. Hello, DeSoto. This is Patricia Ledbetter. I was your mayor pro tem in 2014. I enjoyed being on city council and I especially enjoyed the retreats where we were able to put together our strategic plan for the city. Some of my first votes on council, one involved uh, how much to charge for an ambulance service to the hospital. We were charging $400, but that did not cover the cost to run the ambulance. Also, sidewalks on Chatty Road and the new fire station in a bond proposal. I think my best decision was hiring Dr. Richardson, our city manager. He saw us through the 2009 recession and through a major ice storm. That ice storm cost us almost a quarter of a million dollars. And as a result, we set up the rainy day fund for DeSoto. For those that are interested in leadership, my advice is, first of all, you must show up. Your voice matters. There's power in your participation and be respectful of others and their participation and to always listen. Thank you so much. I'm Denise Valentine. I have a vision for DeSoto that we would become the arts, music, and sports mecca of the best Southwest. By being on city council and becoming mayor pro tem, I was able to be instrumental in laying that groundwork. What I would say to women is to remember, we change the conversation just by being in the room.